city is, is just starting its aquifer storage and recovery well. A few years ago, the city of Buda started exploring aquifer storage recovery, or ASR, as a viable water storage option. A feasibility study was completed in 2016, and City Council later approved the drilling of an ASR pilot well near the Garlic Creek Booster Station and well number five. Drilling of the pilot well started this week. So aquifer storage and recovery is where you store water from one source into a different aquifer formation. So for this, for our particular well here, we're gonna take water from this well here, well five, which is an Edwards Aquifer well, and we're gonna store it in the Trinity Aquifer, which is below. The concept behind ASR is simple. So the Trinity Aquifer here in, in Buda does not move as much as the Edwards Aquifer. So it, it, the water stays in place. So once we inject water down into the aquifer, it'll stay in place, it'll create a storage bubble that we can then utilize during summer months when then our, our, our demand is really high, or if we have a long-term drought, if we go into a long-term drought, and our production from uh, the Edwards Aquifer is cut back or tailed, then we can rely on water that we stored uh, in excess times, and we can utilize that for, for the benefit of the city. The ASR pilot wall will be completed in different phases. Drilling will be finished in May. The overall project will take about a year. So once everything is completed with the site and we have all the piping with the, completed from well five over to the new ASR well, the pump installed, then the, uh, the sampling process will begin, sorry, the injection process. So we'll inject uh, a particular amount of water in, in from the Edwards Aquifer into our ASR well. Then we'll immediately pull that back out. And we'll, as we're pulling that out, well, then we'll take samples, make sure and test the water quality see what type of results we're getting back uh, from that first initial extraction. After that is complete, then we'll go into a larger phase. So we'll, we'll pump in several million more gallons of water into the well, inject it into the well, let it sit for a week or so, and then pull it back out and do the same thing and then test test to make sure, make sure we're getting good water quality. Currently, ASR is successfully being used in cities like San Antonio, El Paso, and Kerrville. Utilizing aquifer storage and recovery is a little bit different than, uh, than having a storage in a, in a lake where we don't have to worry about evaporative losses from the, from the Texas heat. So, so what we're storing down there will stay in place and we'll, we'll be able to use. Aquifer storage and recovery allows the city to be more resilient and it allows us some flexibility on our water supply. So, so having the ability to store water, excess water during during plentiful times for use when we all know the next drought is gonna come is a big benefit for us as a city.